In the eighth verse of chapter six of Isaiah, the Lord is giving Isaiah his commission. God asks, whom shall I send and who will go for us? We receive our commission every day we hear the dreaded sound of that alarm clock. It's determined in that moment whether or not we will have strength in battle, because that's what this game is, a battle, a constant struggle between mental stability and physical toil. Those who master this balance will come out victorious. Take on the challenge every day. No, don't just take it. Run with it. Run as fast as you can until your bones shatter. Better yourself through every step, striving to reach that goal of perfection that always seems to be an inch out of your grasp. Success in our game may be a hit three times out of ten, but it requires a desperate exertion in every second. Know what you're playing for and always have a motivation. This is your God, whatever it may be. Always pray to your God. This is your most important weapon in our war. Never lose thought of what makes you tick. In that sad moment of vulnerability when failure seems imminent, remember your inspiration and let it pick you out of the dirt and push you further. You are going to encounter pain. Shove it deep down inside of you and never let it show. Your dripping blood is like gasoline. Light it and it'll catch fire. Feed that fire constantly and don't let it burn out. Build it up until it is an irrepressible inferno of competitiveness. Your competitive drive will force you to take one more grounder, run out one more rep, and live to see the next game. Be a boulder rolling down an endless hill, crushing everything in your path. Wake up, run, go to the weight room, go hit, go field, go to practice, go to bed, and do it again. Work your butt off every day and never let anyone outdo you. Are you weak? Then go harder. Be your greatest, then get tougher and be greater. Pound on your weaknesses until they no longer are. Now that you've made it this far, there's no stopping, there's no quitting, there's no cutting corners. Laziness is the greatest killer of athletes. Do not succumb to its welcoming embrace because it will choke you out until you breathe your last breath as a ball player. Its brother is pride. There's no excuse to cease your progress even if you're on top of the totem pole because the guy a notch below you is just waiting for his chance to knock you off. Take control of what you can, your head, because if you win the battle on the mental field, physical success is only a step away. The strongest of warriors are the ones with complete containment of their emotions. Shove your feelings down with your pain. Leave only your knowledge of the game and motivation between your ears. Once you've accepted the fact that you've done everything in your power to prepare for battle, you can respond to your commission the same way Isaiah did, by saying, Here I am. Send, Send me. me.